call my mum because I need a little cry. Uh, Let us know when you've got something bigger coming. We have come out on site today to test out the Steel Advanced Procom helmets and headgear. Oh, yes, we have. And we've been joined by MG Tree Care because, well, theoretically, they know what they're doing. I don't because they are cutting stuff off this quarry face and dropping it on the ground and sticking it through the chipper. Perfect test for these helmets and the advanced technology that is in them. Let's check it out. All right, so two willing guys from MG Tree Care very kindly said, look, yeah, we'll try out the helmets, we'll try out the gear, see how it goes. So we're going to ask them to take off their pretty boy helmets and they can have a still advanced Procom helmet each. There we go. No sweat included. <laughs> and I'll have the headgear. We'll send them back up there and see how we get on. Perfect opportunity to try it. One on the ground and then the other one up there. Just have decent communication between your staff. Ready to try it out? Yeah. Let's go for it. Tested by Machinery Nation. Okay, clear. Pick up and we'll come up. Coming up. Okay, clear. Fairly small stuff up there at a minute. Yeah, there's a bit of a mixture there. Then I'll get a bit closer, I can I don't mind it this size. Yeah. Uh, Better slow when you've got something bigger coming. Uh, we will have in two seconds. The helmet's, the helmet's comfy, comfy chaps. chaps. Yeah, yeah, they are nice actually. Lighter than the Proteus, actually. Lighter? Yeah. Get on. Get on. With all the added yeah. te technology in there as well. Any, anything's lighter though. <laughs> What are the earmuffs like next, like to, the next to the chainsaw? Next to the chainsaw? Yeah, the yeah, noise wise. What, I'm it out? Yeah. Yeah, yeah good. So normally, do you guys yeah, just guys normally, normally like just shout, shout at each other, yeah? Yeah. Or let's go down and whistle. Are you going to be able to make the throws on these or? Um, you're going to do it twice. Cut a chunk off, come down, throw it down, and then. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah. All right. Yeah. A bit more beach, beach there, isn't it? Yeah. Nice bit of Vegas or Vatica. Can't beat can't a good Latin name. Name. No, you can't, no. First you got there, Con. In Latin. Workers Ruba. There's no, good workers. There's no, no ash, ash frax from the six Celsius. Celsius. No, no frax. God, it's nice to work on something different. <laughs> yeah, true. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I can imagine most tree traders are just fed up with ash, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You read chat though? Uh, yeah, I should be able to. Feel where that's gone? gone? Yeah, just about. Hey, mate. Hey, mate. Yeah, got a nice little area building now. Just wondering what we're going to do with that. Got on top. I'm coming on. Oh, you got one more. Okay. Right. <gasps> yeah, it's all clear, Con, if you want to check those down. I'm going to double check if we, can't, if we can go in that section over there or not. Right in there? Yeah. It's a proper challenge now because I'm here with the boss of MG Tree Care, oh yes, Matt himself, and we're here with a chipper. And what we want to find out is if we can have a conversation while chipping with the Procom helmets. Let's check it out. Are you the forestry work as well? Yes, yes we've got more. Uh, uh, three clear helmets for this summer. Oh, I do. Uh, guys, you got one now? Uh, uh, two chips on full side. If you're allowed to bring in, yeah. yeah. Normally, for the free surgery time, but summer, summer's quite a time. A nice one to go to put in there. Lovely, isn't it? Beautiful. How do you find this compared to Trotter's work? Yeah, Trotter's. Yeah. Not a question, you guys. <laughs> Can't keep being outside in the nice weather, can you? It's not much meat, is it? Oh, there. Oh, no. I don't want to take away too much from you. You'd be about to carry it all out, today. They even want me to work for you, mate. And I'm there. I'll take a look at that. Sure. Full on conversation while still chatting. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, I'm only, I'm only sweating because I walked up and that didn't. That's a good reason. Otherwise, you 
Maybe just knock it as I am. But you can't be good communication. There you go. Let's check out the specs. So the Procom units come in two different options. So you can either have them as the standard earmuff design, or you can have them as a kit to be able to fit to your current helmet, including the X-Vent and the X-Climb. So these systems will fit exactly onto maybe the helmets you've already got. Or if you've already got a 3M designed helmet, then they'll also fit onto that as well. So when you're working with two headsets, they'll work up to 600 meters apart. But if you expand on that, you can go up to 16 units on one system. So then you can have 600 meters between each worker covering a massive area. The high quality microphone is absolutely brilliant. It is so, so clear, so, so useful. You can put it in next to your face really easily, or if you want to talk to another colleague or perhaps a customer, you can pull it away from your face very quickly and it doesn't pick up so much sound. The noise cancelling within the units is phenomenal. I could not believe how well that works. Yes, when a chainsaw is revving really, really hard, you can still hear it, but when it's just on tick over, you can't. So when Connor was there sawing, you could hear him with the saw, but you couldn't hear it when it is on his hip just ticking over. So it's really pulling out those lighter sounds so that you're not having so much noise coming through to your ears. The controls on the headsets are extremely easy. So you've just got an on button in the middle and then you've got your volume controls each side, a talk button on the back. So if you don't want continuous voiceover, you can just press the button when you want to talk. And then on the other side, you've got connectivity. So you can press that to work with your Siri on your iPhone or your Ask Google or many other things I'm sure there are now. But yeah, you can press that and say, hey Siri, set an alarm for 2 p.m. Or hey Siri, call the boss. Or hey Siri, call my mum because I need a little cry. Whatever it might be, you haven't got to get your phone out of your pocket. Really, really like that feature. And then also there's an FM radio. So on the plus button, if you hold down the plus button and you've programmed it with the app, you can then listen to an FM radio through it flip through the channels, have FM radio while you're working. So if another member of your team wants to talk to you, it'll then cancel the radio off and you can listen to what they're saying. And then once they finish talking, the radio will come back up again. Amazing, love that, really, really good feature. So in the app, it is a really, really good feature to have. So obviously you've probably got your phone in your pocket anyway, so you can have it connected directly to your headset. Let's check out what's on the app. So once you've got your headset connected, it will come up there with the name of the headset. Just below that, you can see it's battery level, which at the moment, this is 50%. The firmware, so you can update your firmware on this as well. The mesh intercom, to be able to connect it with different devices. So you can click into the mesh group to find out who else is on the mesh group and then select channels. So you can have channel one, channel two, channel three. So if you've got say like three different teams working on three different areas, but they're still within the proximity of being able to pick up on each other, you can change the channels between them. You can turn the mesh intercom on and off. And you can go back to the main menu. You should also go into more features where you can change the microphone sensitivity, looking for the range signals, and also change the volume on the slider. You can go into the device settings, change the mesh intercom, so you've got microphone sensitivity, the volume in the FM radio, and tune in the radio that you require. Change the headset language, and also a factory reset. On the FM radio, you can go in, click scan, and choose and program your favorite radio stations. The battery life on these units is up to 17 hours. Yes, 17 hours, but that is very dependent on what you're doing with them. If you're listening to the radio all day or connecting it via Bluetooth to be able to listen to the music that is on your phone, then it is going to use that up a lot, lot quicker than it is if you're just using it for communication purposes. Also, if you've got 16 units on the go then lots more communication is going to be happening, which is going to be using the battery life. If it's just two units on and it's minimal communication I believe that's where the 17 hours will come into play. So I hope this video has been useful and you now know a bit more about the Procom system and how it works and how it can work actually in the real world. I am super impressed of how well it works. I can think of so many uses for them. I jumped in my tractor yesterday as well and thought yeah I could be having these on while I'm driving the tractor and moving something while someone's out sawing with that one and I can keep clear communication with them. There's just so many possibilities and it just creates a much safer working environment as well as a more efficient and working environment because you're not shouting, you're not whistling, you're not wasting time thinking, ah, oh, I can't see Bill, I can't hear Bill, I better go and check on Bill. You can just talk to him. You haven't got to go and find him. You haven't got to try and ring him on his mobile. It's in his pocket that he can't hear. You can just go, Bill, what are you doing? And I think that is brilliant. I don't know why we haven't tested them sooner. I want to do it again. I want to film more with these. I think there's more we could do. Any ideas you've got for a video that we could use with the Procom, pop it in the comments because I quite like to make it because it's going to be worth it. But thank you very much for watching. We're 
Machinery Nation, and we bring you videos every Tuesday and Friday all about tools and machinery. So if you haven't already, please click subscribe, like the video, ding the notification bell so you get notified every time we bring out a new video. And, well, we'll see you in the next one. Cheerio!